second half about to start. Rochester will be attacking the goal to our our right, I guess. They're going to be coming down our way. That's number two, Salah, Ortiz, Miller, Manson, Nett to start for the next one. Salas will have the kickoff. Plays it to Nap. Just drives it forward on that set piece they like to do so much with the boards. And Mantic picks up the ball instead midfield. So Mauricio, slide tackle there by Lemons. Looking for Beasley, good time tackle there. How's that a foul? That's a bad call. Wow, he got the ball. I can't believe he called that. Perfectly time tackle by Knapp in front of the Lancers bench. Billy Andracki and Jimmy Hesch have a few chance wo choice words for the referee as he's standing in front of the bench. Now back here to... Harding, middle of the field, Perez, Rivio. Okay, Billy Drek is the best dressed coach in this league. He, the guy dresses like, I, he should be a GQ model. I wish I could dress like Looking that. Looking sharp tonight with the Hickey Freeman Duds as he is front and center on the bench. Leading his Lancers here tonight, but Rivio has the ball on the other side of the field. Coming the other way, his shot is blocked. Salas gets the ball forward to Miller on the far side. Miller one-on-one -on -one with Harding gets around him off the boards Carvalho's changed jerseys in the red top now he's gone to the green top plays it out to Perez the wings spring all the way down the other way now fast action up and down back and forth I love it and they don't hesitate they don't keep the ball in their half for a long period of time at all they get deep and they get it forward real quick there's Carvalho Sinaldo, I guess he should go by. That's what he likes. That's what he likes, Sinaldo, because it sounds like Ronaldo. Makes Close. him sound real Brazilian. Yep. You got it. Leave off the board there by Perez. And a foul called. Ortiz was the player who went down. Perez knocked him down. Man, Ortiz getting beat up here. Hey, you know, we got to give a little shout out to the GM here of the Wichita Wings, John Blazek. He gave Don Vieira and I an amazing tour of the, one of the nicest arenas, indoor soccer arenas I've ever been to. Gave us a tour, showed us around. Just did an amazing job. As he was introducing you guys, uh, I walked into the hospitality suite, and he said, these are the owners of the rise. Oh, i got to walk out now. They're, they're <laughs> conducting business. Foul called on the long throw from Sinaldo. I, I, I kind of like it, this Wichita, Joe. It's very nice here. Very nice scenery. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> Tom, <laughs> Tom here is looking like, what, what are you guys watching? <laughs> <laughs> to loot deep in the corner. Chile bothering him, forcing him to go all the way back to Kirosh. Now Beasley, one-on-one -on -one with Foskey, gets around him. Shot with the right foot is blocked as Renfro came in to support and help out. Beasley has the ball again, tries to turn. His shot is blocked by Renfro. Chile's dumped off the ball by Kirosh, and it'll be picked up by Bouton. Bouton spinning away, away from the pressure. Nice play. Of the Wichita Wings. Beasley's one of those guys where if you play him hard, he's, he's not going to do much. They just, they're playing him hard, and he's, he's not, not moving to the ball well because they're chopping him hard. And knock on wood, he's been quiet tonight. As Mancic gets the long ball, tries to head it across the box. Nobody there for the Lancers. Kirosh has it now. Victor Kirosh, a 35-year-old from Mexico. The Mexican futsal and beach soccer player. Gets it to Perez. Now Kirosh has it on the near side. Pushing it towards the middle. Long ball into the corner now. Mosley. Perez. Well, the wings are slowing down their attack here. Isn't it that run and gun style? We've seen so much. Good turn there by Mosley. And Mancic steps in front. The shot by Viegas is saved by Hannigan. Back up in front. And an empty net goal there for Mosley. Not going to find easier ones than that. Hannigan made the initial save. And then it took a wild bounce off the boards back in front. And Mosley there to poke it into the empty net. We are tied at 11. Well, I mean, it's just, it's just crazy stuff. It kind of bounced off Kyle Mantic's foot right, right, to, right to them. It was like one of those weird bounces, and it kind of slowed down. And they just had open net and just shot. And Hennigan had no chance on that. And, uh, you know, they're, they're, it's a tie, another tie game. But, man, the, the atmosphere is just truly amazing. So they've tied the game at 11. Sinaldo comes out with the header, comes out to the yellow line where Ortiz will go one-on-one -on -one with Reveal. Back to the center circle, Schindler. This one's going back and forth. 
you get to feel there's going to be a sixth attacker one way or the other. This has been nail-biting action. Sonaldo gets it through the midfield area to Luke. Right to find Reveal, but intercepted by Ortiz. Can't keep possession there. Reveal come away with it. Good ball forward for Villegas. Hannigan is off his line. Clears it out to the middle of the field where Reveal will pick it up. On the left foot. Shot in the goal! Sneaks under the left arm of Pat Hannigan. And that's what Hannigan's going to want back. He should have had that. Wow. It was a blast, though, lower corner. This guy just joined this team a couple days ago. Doesn't even have his name on his jersey yet. They just gave him the number 10, no name on it. He's just an amazing player. Reveal, just a lower blast, lower corner. Maybe Hannigan was screened. We're pretty far away, but hey, what are you going to do? The Wichita Wings are up right now 13 to 11. So Reveal scored it 13 30 in the first quarter. He's got his second goal as a wing, second goal of the game. And that one comes at 425. Didn't get the assist on that one yet. But Hannigan is furious. He is not happy with himself right now. Well, I mean, Joe, I mean, the guy's one of those players where a guy that could kick the ball hard and low and this kind of turf is, this is not like the turf at the Blue Cross Arena. This is like smooth Italian living room carpet that you put in your garage, the Italian Much living room. faster surface. Yeah, it's really, really fast. He hits it low and hard. It just skids off the turf. That one was a worm burner, as we've been called before. As they've been called before, it's just hugging along the turf. Hennigan got down, but it was already in the back of the net. 13 to 11 now, Wichita leads it. Rochester at the half had an 11 to 9 lead. What a game. Kickoff after the Lancers took a timeout. Hoxie and Boughton bothering Harding on that far side. And foul called on Mancic for taking down Perez. Amazing how fast things can turn. Absolutely incredible. Joe, we're talking real quick about John Blazik, the GM. Took, gave us a tour. They own this facility. They, they control the concessions, the merchandise. It's like a dream come true for, for the game of MISL soccer, this building. I think it is the perfect MISL venue. I think it is absolutely the perfect size. Not, not too many bells and whistles, but I think just enough to keep the fans content. Very nice venue. Very nice building. Good job here in Wichita. Music blasting. Crowd dancing. But Hoxie has the ball coming the other way. Two on one. Hoxie. Shot. And a goal! Del Polk upper corner! Hoxie has the Lancers even at 13. The big one. The big smooth Andrew Hoxie gets the ball from, from uh, Kyle Mantic. Just kind of in the middle field. Yeah, I'll, I'll dribble a little bit, wait for a defender. No defender comes to him. He sees Doug Miller cutting on the opposite side. He fakes like he's going to pass to Miller. Instead, he just, boom, toe pokes it upper corner. What a shot by the big, smooth Andrew Hoxie. So Mancic has got his third assist of the year, second of the night. And Hoxie, 13th goal of the season. Time of the goal, 5:04. Tied at 13, Hannigan tries to clear it. Reveal picks it up in his shot. Is cleared off the line by Foskey. Hannigan has had trouble with his distribution tonight. Well, on his feet, he has struggled. Yeah, I, I think he's struggling with his turf here, but the, but the Mohican Warrior, he saw his goalie come out of the net. Yes. What does he do? He steps back in, and he says, all right, let me, let me cover it in this area. Came right to him and saved the goal. Great job by the Mohican Warrior. I love, Andrew. I love the fact how you can find the positive in a situation. I really do. It's amazing. It's a very unique ability. Well, I, my wife taught me that because she finds the positive in me. <laughs> <laughs> That's very tough to do. All right, we're tied at 13, and it's going to be nail-biting time as I don't see this one getting blown open one way or the other. As the Lancers have the ball with Hannigan now, deep at the other end of the arena. Ball into the corner, and Sonaldo will pick it up there for the Wichita Wings, who started in 1979. To Lutz on the far side, Perez drives it across. Oh. Hannigan makes the kick save. What a save by Patrick Hannigan. Nice lows. Amazing. Lemons. Now back to Sinaldo. How, how about our staff, Joe? How about Mikey Moran, James Weissy, and Eric Trendle doing their thing 24-7? Then you got Rich Randall and Donna. Whoa. Sorry, Joe. Long shot there from Lemons. Wow, that was close. Our team is giving a shout-out to the staff with 8.07 left in the 
third quarter. We are tied at 13. Loose ball picked up by Mauricio. Coming one-on-one. -on -one. Good step there by Inlaw. In low to break it up. Miller, though, is on the loose ball. Back to Hannigan. Schindler. Nowhere to go. Plays it to Hannigan. 1-2 Ortiz and Schindler. Chip Ford Miller tries to get the head it. Villegas wins that battle. Heads it deep into Lancer's half. Ortiz looks like he's all healed up, though. He's moving and dancing and doing his magic here with the ball at his feet. Jeremy Ortiz, what a player. Hannigan forward for Hoxie. Can't get the ball. But Mancic's going to just win this hard challenge there. So back to Sinaldo. Headed forward. Hoxie's in front. Still pressured by Lubo. Shot. Sinaldo makes the save. Intense pressure from the Lancers in the Wichita half of the field. Shot there by Renfro. Headed up and almost over the hand of Sinaldo and into the back of the net. But the Wichita Wings keeper scoops it up. Rolls it forward for Beasley. Stripped of the ball nicely by Schindler. Here comes Chile the other way now. One-on-one -on -one with Kiroche. Plays it instead to Lubo. Just outside the arc, Lubo with that patented step-over move. Oh, I love that move, Joe. Now Knapp. Lancers are making some changes here with 6.32 left in the third quarter. Hannigan will drive one deep into the corner. Kiroche steps in front of Chile. Now Becerra comes up, scoops up the loose ball. Hannigan has it. 6.08 left. Another long ball into the corner for Chile. Chile and Kiroche continue the battle. Chile rocks one off the glass. Comes across to the near side where Bouton has it. Now Knapp. Calm and cool, Brayton Knapp. The 26-year-old MISL Defender of the Month. And probably Defender of the Year, if I had my way. If you had your way, everyone in blue and gold would be Players of the Year, the Week, the Month. <laughs> Century. Century. <laughs> now the Wings will come back on the far side. Viegas. Hannigan's got to be quick off his line. As their teams were making changes, two Wings players stayed on. They went in a two-on-one situation. Hannigan broke it up. Long ball into the corner for Mauricio. Little tug on the jersey. Kiroche gets away with it. Plays it forward to Perez. Just over five minutes remaining in the third quarter. The Lancers and the Wings are tied at 13. Reveal looking for the hat trick. Plays it into Beasley. Back up top now for Harding. 38 years old. He began his indoor career with the Wichita Wings. With the ball now, number 16, Harding. Jamie Harding. Sinaldo has it now. Back to Lemons. Spins away from Miller. Crosses midfield. Back to Lemons deep in the corner. Off the chest. Back to the goal. And this one's cleared up by Lemons into the crowd. And it'll be a free kick coming out for the Rochester Lancers. And looks like we're going to take our... Official timeout right now with 4.28 left in the third quarter. The Lancers and the Wichita Wings are tied at 13 on Fickle 93.3. Stick with us through this quick timeout. More Lancers action is next on Fickle 93.3. God, it was so much fun. I just laughed the whole time. It's the perfect date night. Hilarious, awesome show. Everyone loves Jiva Theater Center's Perfect Wedding, a hilarious comedy of unbridled proportions. It was like two hours of nonstop laughs. On stage through February 12th. Tickets start at $25. Call 232-JIVA or online at jivatheater.org. It's a sexy madcap roller coaster ride to the altar with Perfect Wedding. What's fresh and fun to show how much you love your special Valentine? The Husbands Love Your Wives Valentine Gala, Friday night, 7 o'clock, February 10th at Burgundy Basin. Dinner prepared by a gourmet chef. Slow roasted prime rib and baked fresh blue water Atlantic salmon with creme brulee for dessert. Lots of laughs provided by comedian Brad Todd. And live music, perfect for romance and dance. It's the Valentine Gala, Friday night, February 10th at Burgundy Basin. A night to remember. Tickets available at opendoormission.com. Think of all the things you dislike about the car buying experience. You don't trust salespeople who work on commission. You don't like being passed around from department to department, waiting for manager approvals, the finance department phone tag, while your precious time disappears. You believe the only way to get the best price is to haggle for it. 
I'm Rick Dorschel, and we've been listening to you. So we're doing things differently. Introducing Clear and Simple, our new approach for doing business. Our sales staff doesn't work on commission, and you'll work with one salesperson from the test drive to your drive home. The clear, competitive price you see online is the same one you'll find right on the vehicle. And it's our best price. So you don't have to be a great negotiator to get a great deal. It's a great way to sell cars and a better way to buy them. At Dorschel, it's clear, it's simple, it's different. So visit Dorschel.com or come see us at the dealership today. Fickle 93.3 plays everything, even mid-sized city indoor soccer. More Lancers soccer on Fickle 93.3. And during the break, Andrew Hossi just scored to give the Lancers a 16 to fi- or 15 to 13 lead. Hoxie's second goal of the corner, 14th of the year, stand a little mixed up in front, and Hoxie with a toe poke again, just trickles it over the line to get his 14th of the year. Jeremy Ortiz gets the ball to Lubo. Lubo just gives Hoxie a little ball in the front. Nobody comes at him. He just toe pokes and gets a goal. Like It was like seconds, man, seconds into it. Lubo to Hoxie, another goal and another assist for Lubo. So Lubo gets the assist. Hannigan will drive this one forward, looking for some help off the boards. Now Chile intercepted there by Revijo. Lubo's got seven assists on the year. Lemons coming forward. Mosley across the goal mouth, looking for some help there. Harding takes a shot. It's blocked. Harding shooting for the goal for those three-pointers. They're, they're looking for those long, long goals here, long shots, and uh, maybe a little fatigue. 3.30 left in the third quarter. Wichita trailing 15 to 13. Shot off the glass in the corner. Hoxie. I'm sorry. Hannigan. High boot up in the air. Throws it downfield, though, as he picked up that loose ball. Takes an awkward bounce off the boards, and Mansick, I think, Really had no choice but to foul there against Perez. Nice professional foul by future U.S. national team player Kyle Mantic. Beasley back across the goal mouth, and Mantic is there to step on it quickly for the Lancers. Back across now, Kirosh. Mantic again steps in front of that. Miller picks up the loose ball. 2.45 left. Miller to Salas on the near side. And Sinaldo will clear this one up over the glass. It'll be a free kick from the side Wow! for the Lancers. Sinaldo, a little mental mistake there. He could have just picked up that ball and taken control. Instead, he uh, decided to kick it out of bounds. Seems a little rattled for a, a keeper with that much experience. That was a poor choice by the 34-year-old. I don't think he's ever seen designer uniforms like this before. <laughs> that can mess you up. Chile on the free start. Hard shot from Knapp. It's not too far off the mark on the near side. Wow. Rocks it off the glass. Brayton, I said Brayton, yeah, what a shot. Oh. And again to Hoxie, header into the corner. Lubo fighting there with Inlow. Hoxie comes in to steal it. Hoxie's starting to feel it here in this third quarter. He's got two goals. He's now confident. Nap. He's confident. He's feeling good. 2.08 left. Back into Sinaldo, and he's going to pounce on the ball. As Hoxie again was looking for a hat trick in quarter number three alone. 156 left. Stolen away by Chile. Or Becerra. They got that same haircut, Sam. Hard to tell. Yeah, they do. They went, well, they got a deal. You know, the guy, the guy knew one cut. And the whole <laughs> team got the same haircut. <laughs> He's like, what do you like? Well, I like this one. They all look, they all ask for different haircuts. They all got the exact same haircut. Well, you got Nelson, Mauricio, and Chile all with that same Mohawk look. And Dave Pasquale, well, kind of. Kind of, but that's not by design. <laughs> that's by Mother Nature. Uh, I love that guy. <laughs> he is great. As the Lancers will long ball into the box, and Aldo will pick it up. Kirosh with 127 left. Into the box, Hannigan pounces on that one. Throws it long downfield, looking for the foot of Ortiz, but broken up. Now Reveal coming again. He's dangerous. Top of the arc for Lemons. Off the board. Slide there by Fosky to clear it away. Crowd getting excited when Reveal's got the ball. He was pushing down the middle of the field. They were up on their feet, and Hannigan clears it up and into the crowd. With one minute remaining, one minute exactly remaining in the third quarter. 
one of the famous celebrities from this area, Christy Alley. That's right, you were saying that. Born today. and raised, she comes here a lot, her family still lives here, and she's seen around town a lot. Christy Alley of Cheers fame. Dancing with the Stars most recently. He also said some guy comes here to get his plane fixed. Yeah, we're going to talk about that next. Free kick for Perez. Outside shot is up and off the glass. Chili, overhead kick, clears it down the middle of the field. Ortiz chasing this one down, but instead the wings come away with it. Sinaldo to Perez, 47 seconds left in the third quarter. Mosley to Reveal. Has the little wrap around the arms of Ortiz, takes him down in the corner. And Angel Reveal, who scored the 2002 A League goal of the year, has been an immediate impact for LeBaron. Holloman, the head coach of the Wichita Wings. Wow, yeah, he's he's an amazing player. There's Salas, near side boards, plays it to Fosky, who just came off the bench. Elliot Fosky, two goals this year, although point streak had him as one as of this morning. He's got two. Scored a goal in Baltimore as well. As Norfolk, the goal in Baltimore is actually credited to Andrew Hoxey, but. But we've gone to Foskey. Yeah, we knew it. We knew that that was the second goal. But you know, we got to go by what Point Streak. Right. Point Streak says that hey, they didn't give it to him. I mean, that's just how it is. It's our job though to kind of try to fight that, and, and we're doing that. At yeah, the Eric office. Trimble has a league uh, a request into the league. The Wings carry the ball into the crowd. Free kick for the Lancers. Miller to Mauricio on the near side, and referee calls a foul. Not sure what the foul was though, Sam. He went like this, Joe. What does that mean? I don't know. Tell the fans what you're doing. <laughs> I can see what you're doing. What are the fans? I don't know what you call it. Maybe elbowing? It's kind of elbowing. <laughs> kind of elbowing. All right, third quarter comes to a close. All to do in quarter number four. The Lancers have a 15-13 to 13 lead over the Wichita Wings on Fickle 93-3.